Hello, hello. Just to fit my camera. Nice yeah, meeting you, sir. Everything is okay. How are you, sir? Uh, very well. Rather busy. I just finished with the, the international group of students um, the seminar, and uh, now I am uh, devoting my time to you. And thank you very much for a very thorough oh, okay. uh, pre preparation of this uh, Zoom session and questions. Okay, okay. Thank you. Actually, this will be the recorded conversations. There is any problem? No, there is no problem at all. Okay. And uh, we will start the uh, these discussions in Hindi and English. I will ask the question in uh, English from your side, but I will also use Hindi word in the video. Okay. Okay. For, for my viewers, since uh, our channel is uh, view, uh, viewed from worldwide countries. All right. No yes. problem about this. So first you will pose uh, the question in Hindi or uh, and in English or... Nay, no, I will ask the question from English only from you. When you will give ah. me the answer, I will explain to the people in Hindi. Ah, okay, right, right, right. <laughs> Afterwards. Okay. No problem. Today, uh, BISE team of uh, Medicine University of Zagreb, Croatia, he is with us. And firstly, I welcome you on this YouTube channel from my side. Namaste. Namaskar. Thank you very much for your kind invitation, and I'm very happy to join you uh, at this occasion. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Actually, we have a number of uh, Indian students. Those are looking for medicine degree, especially in Croatia itself. That is a Schengen country. And we are regularly sending the number of students in another Schengen countries like uh, Romania, Bulgaria, Hungary, Czech Republic, Latvia, Lithuania, Estonia. In these countries, we are also sending the medicine students. And now we have the students, those are interested to get the admission in Croatia. This is the very prominent university, a Jagrab Medicine University is very prominent university. And I will ask some question. Since these questions, these questions uh, asked by the students from me, as well as, well as the parents, when they are met, uh, they are coming in my office for the purpose of counseling. So first question I will ask you, about the university. Can you tell me when this university was found? Yeah, the university was uh, founded actually uh, mid uh, 17th century, century in 1668. Okay. Uh, we at that time in Croatia were a part of the huge uh, empire, which uh, for European circumstances, of course, uh, <clears throat> which is called the uh, Austria Hungarian Empire or oh. Habsburg Empire. So it encompasses um, a lot of countries that you talked about. So Czech Republic, Hungary, uh, Romania, parts of Germany, parts of Italy, uh, etc. So we have uh, a long-standing uh, tradition and the university is the major university in the country. It has um, uh, 75,000 uh, students, but of course, when we are talking about Zagreb University uh, School of Medicine, uh, there are approximately 3,000 students with us, including uh, postgraduate uh, students. There are also uh, 300 uh, students in our international program as well. Okay, very nice. It is very good information you share with me. Sorry to ask, you have not given me your introduction. Tell me about yourself also, sir. <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> yes. Uh, I'm Davar Ježek. Um, uh, don't bother about uh, our names, uh, Davar or Dave, Americans, uh, my American yes, colleagues, yes. they call me Dave, so it's not a problem. Uh, and uh, I'm actually um, a vice dean for international program here for uh, medical studies in English. I established uh, the program uh, in 2003. And uh, as you can see, we have a rather long tradition, more than 20 uh, years now um, of existence of this uh, program. Uh, I have actually two uh, arms. Uh, first of all, uh, it's uh, the basic science arm, uh, which is teaching at the university. So I'm a full professor of histology and embryology. Very and uh, my right arm or left arm, if whatever, <laughs> Uh, is um, <clears throat> a clinical arm, uh, which is actually andrology or mm. male infertility. Mm -hmm. uh, unfortunately, I'm dealing with uh, this um, male infertility problematics uh, at uh, the University Hospital Zagreb. University mm. Hospital Zagreb, in a few words, 
is the major facility, also medical facility in Croatia. It has more than 6,000 employees. Mm -hmm. It has 43 operational theaters. Um, I don't know, uh, more than 22,000 uh, examinations uh, in a half year period. Uh, a lot of patients uh, that come, uh, there are 1,200 um, um, medical doctors employed and the rest, of course, are uh, okay. other assistants and uh, health uh, providers. Very so nice. In short, about me and about the setting uh, okay. where I work. Thank you very much. It is nice introduction. Sir. Now we will come to the points about the programs, about this medicine degree. How many vacancies, how many seats for international students in your university for medicine program, as well as for the uh, dentistry, both the programs in English, how, many, uh, how much the seats you have? Okay, so uh, actually the dentistry school is separated okay. from uh, the medical school and there is a uh, a uh, good friend of mine, uh, Ivan Alaybek, who is uh, a vice dean for a dentistry program in English. He was educated in the United States, and I think uh, you can reach him without any problems. I can okay, provide no you problem. later on with... with so later uh, on, we can discuss. Time. Today, we can discuss only for medicine. Medicine, how many seats? Exactly. So, international program, as I already told you, has approximately 300 um, uh, students. Uh, they come from... Uh, in total 29 countries, but mm. most of them are coming from uh, um, United States, Canada, um, Australia, uh, then Israel, um, some some people from Germany, Austria. So it's a quite a mix uh, of, uh, of uh, countries. Hey, uh, and, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm asking about the how many seats per year per medicine. Beg your pardon, how many? Seeds, how many vacancies per medicine program per year? Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, the quota, annual quota uh, or intake of students is uh, 70. So it's not a huge program, okay, okay, but 70. it has it, its advantages. Okay. Uh, the advantage is actually that uh, you can have a direct contact with your teacher. <clears throat> you have your practically um, a, a group of students, uh, three or four of, of you are attending, for instance, one dissection table at the anatomy department. And uh, to be honest, we don't want to expand uh, this uh, number because I think it properly fits uh, into <clears throat> our setting. Uh, our aim is quality first. So yes, that is no, that is no important. massive influx of students. I understand. We need we need the quality. We yeah. also need the quality. Mm, absolutely. And, okay. The second thing about the admission criteria, how the international student can get the admissions in your university for medicine program. Thank you for this question. I think it's rather important and re relevant. So uh, first of all, one has to have um what we call the uh, elementary school, that's uh, of course uh, essential prerequisite. Then in Europe, we have secondary school, which I think equals in India and some yeah. other countries to college or something like that, mm -hmm. a, a college degree. And then uh, advanced uh, college degree uh, is also uh, 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 legitimate or candidates can also apply if they are already uh, acquired uh, actually uh, some kind of university degree. For instance, we had some experience with Indian uh, students that um, already had um, a degree in biotechnology Great. or some other um, biology. So mm. th these people <clears throat> can, of course, uh, consider to be um, admitted directly. However, they have to fulfill certain criteria. Uh, first of all, they have to have physics, chemistry, and biology. I understand. So this is very important. The physics, yes. chemistry, oh. and biology, uh, at least two years of um, uh, teaching and passing the exam. Okay. And, uh, of course, uh, uh, to have uh, provide, providing uh, actually uh, sufficient documentation from their um, mother universities that they uh, finish this degree. However, for the younger candidates, uh, we have online exam. So okay. it's 
uh, very important to know that you there is no necessity to uh, come and fly to Croatia to take the entrance exam. It's an uh, online exam mm -hmm. from physics, chemistry, and biology. Okay. Usually we have four <clears throat> exams per year. We are going already to start in January. Okay. And then uh, we will have uh, uh, probably one exam <clears throat> uh, at, the, at the end of April, beginning of May, okay. and then uh, in June and July. Okay. What is uh, January very important for candidates, uh, for instance, from uh, India, because uh, they need some time to apply for visa. No, yes, of course. Very, very, very important point. Very important. No so, certification no process, many things are there. No yeah. yeah, yeah, I know. So, so it's very, very uh, important, important to apply, for instance, for January exam. What is also a very important piece of information, if you by any chance fail okay. uh, the exam, uh, there are no negative um, points or repercussions. You can actually uh, repeat the exam, for instance, uh, beginning of uh, May or end of April. We will see uh, mm -hmm. about this or later on. Okay. So okay. these are the basic. Uh, what is tested? Uh, tested uh, the, um, uh, physics, chemistry, Bio. biology, and there is also situation test, which uh, actually <clears throat> uh, is testing your a compassion you're uh, able to be uh, motivation a good interview. doctor motivation yeah. interview yeah it's uh, it, the passing rate of this part is is uh, huge mm -hmm. however please pay attention to physics and chemistry it and highly depends upon your background or in the secondary school or college so one should have a good knowledge of it and last information sorry for keeping you uh, waiting, is uh, we have also published one uh, online uh, book okay. that uh, has um, uh, actually a collection of uh, typical questions uh, from each area. <clears throat> okay, very good. Yeah. It is very uh, good. The, the test consists of 120 questions, mm -hmm. 40 questions per each area. Okay. Uh, and you have to have a 61 in order mm. to pass, mm -hmm. and also a uh, minimum 17 from the test um, subgroup. So the okay, subgroup are physics, physic, uh, physics I mean, and biology, yeah, yes. because we cannot take somebody who is brilliant only in biology. biology. You will be from all the other areas. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you for your patience. <laughs> okay, second, second thing about the grade. You will check about the grade in 12th in the schooling grades. Actually, How much uh, percentage? actually, you will be surprised this is not so relevant for us. Okay, very we, good. We, we, as long as the candidate has, uh, you know, finished uh, degrees uh, or at least secondary school and has at least two uh, years of physics, chemistry and biology in this college education or secondary school, mm -hmm. we are going to consider him or her a legitimate candidate. Okay. What is very important for us is actually demonstration of knowledge at the, at the entrance exam. Very good, nice. And mm -hmm. about and about the you are accepting another exam like SAT, SAT, SAT exam about IMAT yes. exam. You are accepting it or not? As yes, we are accepting exactly, sir. Thank you for asking this. So SATs are also accepted. Uh, there is a threshold that we. Uh, you know, accept uh, it is in our on our web page. It is uh, BMAT, BMAT, UCAT exams like that one. BMAT also. Uh, so okay. this this can be also um, uh, a fit candidates for us. Uh, so these these two systems, either US or a UK system, is yeah, okay. UK system is like that. UCAT and BMAT exam. About this online exam, there is any there is any fee for online exam. Uh, yes, there is, oh but only once. If you, if you, by any chance, and I hope not, uh, <laughs> fail, you are not going to uh, pay again for this fee. Mm -hmm. So the fee is two hundred and fifty euro. Okay, nice. Yeah. And the second thing about the tuition fees per year. How much the tuition fees per year? So the tuition fee per year is twelve thousand euro. Okay, and well, what is very important 
if uh, you come to us at certain academic year and enroll and we have a contract, then this 12 euro, 12,000 euro remains until the end of your studies. Very. So there are no unpleasant surprises or something like that uh, during the study period. It's the same price, okay. always. Uh, about the clinical training, clinical rotations, tell me about the clinical rotation in this program. Yeah, these are very important uh, ones. Uh, so this is why uh, people learn um, a little bit creation. It's not absolute, um, uh, let's say, uh, prerequisite, but uh, it's very nice to pick up some words uh, in creation language as well. Uh, so there are um, actually a series of uh, courses, uh, uh, creation language one, two, and three, um, standing for first year, then second year, and third year of studies. Okay. So we count that uh, during the third year of your study, you, you will know a little bit Croatian as well. Although I have to tell you, Croatia is an uh, English spoken environment. Uh, city is um, <laughs> very much international. And we have a lot of uh, international workers here. Yes, and yes. Uh, if I order something in, in a, a supermarket and uh, the butcher is uh, some somebody coming from, uh, you know, international yes. environment, the, 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 the line... This is very small, but this is very small country, but it is very famous in football. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, you are very well informed. You are very well informed. Yeah, yeah. so, so it's... Um, I, I would say English is is very uh, widespread, and also uh, we try to find some patients that also uh, are communicable in in English. Mm. <clears throat> Although uh, it is desirable to pick up some some Croatian language. Okay, there is also a possibility to go abroad if you okay. are our student. Then you uh, can be involved into uh, Erasmus program. Mm -hmm. We have various contracts with uh, other um, countries like uh, Germany, Austria, Italy, um, Slovenia, Hungary, many, great. many countries. Great, great. And you, can, you can also go uh, for clinical rotations. Mm -hmm. And at the very end of, of your stay here or your studies, there is a block uh, about uh, three months or even more now. Uh, that is dedicated only for clinical rotations that you okay. can do either here or uh, in Abroad. the country, your choice. It can be India, it can be uh, United Kingdom, it can be United States, Canada, whatever. But okay. it, it, it is um, <clears throat> organized uh, so, so uh, one should pay attention that uh, there are uh, certain um, prerequisites or bait, uh, like, uh, for instance, half of the uh, clinical rotations are conservative medicine without surgery and half are surgical disciplines. But hey. um, uh, this is something that is happening uh, at the sixth year of uh, medical studies. Otherwise, we have early exposure of students to uh, patients. So already in the first year, they, they are talking to patients. Uh, <clears throat> there is one, um, one um, longitudinal subject uh, which uh, extends through all six years of uh, studies, and this is Fundamentals of Medical Skills. Very good, nice. Oh. This is, uh, a, a <clears throat> per year, a block that consists of communication. So you learn how to communicate with patient, how to uh, break anxiety of a patient, how to adapt uh, to to patient, and uh, how to uh, break his uneasiness, let's say. And uh, the major part, of course, are various situations you can <clears throat> intervene. For instance, somebody faints in a tram or bus. What can you do? Uh, there is a lot of um, simulations on mummies, you know, uh, dolls uh, of various sizes. So this is these fundamentals of medical skills that is very important for preparing uh, people for actual uh, clinical work and um, rotations at the hospital. Thank you. Actually, this video will be very long 
actually it is my humble look it i it is it is very interesting it is very interesting and those people are looking for mbbs in croatia they will must watch this video anyhow it is my humble request i want another two or three zoom meeting in the next coming days if it is possible since we have a lot of questions from you about the accommodation about the local license about yeah. about the safety for the girls since many parents ask these questions from me and how whether they can practice in croatia after doing the medicine degree whether they can eligible to practice in uk after doing the, uh, this degree there is a number of more questions and uh, it is my humble request in the next two session uh, two or three session i want from your side if it is possible yeah it is possible we have just have to arrange the dates uh, the, when i'm not in operation of okay, yes I would you, be very happy to okay, answer your question. Okay, I I am at your disposal. Whenever you have the time, you just send me the message. Okay, you have that that schedule. I can immediately arrange the meeting for this uh, very lucrative conversation, sir. Okay, thank you very much for thank your you. interest. I think this week is uh, good for me in general. Okay, at this at this approximate time, I can I can actually send you an email. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Thanks for sharing this uh, wonderful information with uh, us as well as for the international student. Thank you very much. Namaskar, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. <laughs>